One of the biggest is in Frankenmuth, the Bavarian Festival, where one group of ladies is revving up their motorcycles right now, all for a good cause. NBC 25's Ilse Lujan Hayes joins us live from Frankenmuth with that story. Good morning, Ilse. Good morning, guys. Well, you know, I'm outside the Bavarian Inn restaurant where this evening the uh, big events happening and it will all go toward local wounded soldiers. Now joining us right now is three members of the Sirens Motorcycle Ladies Club. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Now, um, I have to say that you you will be raising money later today for a big charity, but I want to hear about this group. How long have you been riding and when did you think of this idea of, of uh, organizing the group? Okay, um, I've actually been riding for 20 years and uh, the Sirens Motorcycle Club started about 11 years ago. And why did you decide to do that? Well, I just, I really don't know what the reason was. I just thought it would be fun to have women riding together. Um, it's certainly not the first women's motorcycle club, but there wasn't anything local that, you know, was available, so. Now you told me I'm not, you know, your husband and the other guys used to go from bar to bar, not saying that that's the only thing riders do, but you right. said that that was another reason why, because we have some pictures of that we're showing viewers of things that you guys do together. Yes, exactly. Um, you know, we, we do all kinds of things. We ride up, you know, northern Michigan just locally. We'll go out to dinner. We'll just meet for ice cream. Yeah. Um, really, there's any excuse yeah. is fine. Just to ride and, and let that wild side out. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, another important thing that the uh, Sirens Motorcycle Club does is raise money. And so, again, tonight here outside of the Bavarian Inn restaurant, a big event is happening. The bikes, beer, and cash bash. And, again, benefiting local wounded soldiers. Now coming up a little later, I'm going to attempt, I'm wearing these big heels, guys, and in honor of, you know, heels on wheels, I'm gonna hop on one of these bikes. Do you trust me with your bike? Sure. I wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> I promise I'll take care of it. For now, live in Frankenmuth, Ilse Lujan Hayes, NBC 25. And as part of that festival, one group of ladies are revving up their bikes in Frankenmuth, and it's all for a good cause. NBC 25's Ilse Lujan Hayes joining us live from Frankenmuth with the story. Good morning, Ilse. Hey, guys. Good morning. I'm hanging out outside the Bavarian Inn restaurant this morning where later today a big event is happening. It's called the Bikes Beer Cash Bash. And here to tell us more about it is Barry. Good morning. Come on over. So I'm on this bike, of course, and I'm having a lot of fun. But the ladies that are part of this motorcycle club, they're, they're um, raising money for a good cause. Yep, at the 98 KCQ Bikes, Beer, and Cash Bash is a, a, a big event. It's a, a fundraiser for the Fallen and Wounded Soldiers Fund of Michigan. KCQ is going to be out here on the, on the Fisher Plots at 5 o'clock with a prize promotion giveaway called Climb for Cash. So people I, have a chance to win all kinds of prizes. It's summertime. Cash, gift cards, uh, lots of great prizes. And then we have live country music at 7 o'clock with Mandy Lane and the Lost Highway. What time does all this start? Five o'clock is the, uh, the the prize giveaway promotion and registration for the the bikes, mm -hmm. and then seven o'clock is live country music on the stage. Very cool. So uh, of course you are. I'm joined by the some of the members of the Sirens Motorcycle Club. Julie here has been kind enough to um, let allow me to hop on her bike. Tell us about this bike real quick. Um, it's a Sportster 48, 2010. It's modeled after 1948 um, Harley Davidson motorcycle. Mine's just a little bit more customized than you get in the store. Yours is fancy. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> now you have taught me how to start this baby up and yeah. I'm going to attempt to do that. Okay. So um, you guys in true honor of, you know, heels on wheels, as you can see, I'm wearing my heels now. They've told me that they really don't ride with heels, but I'm going to do it. Okay. So I'm going to turn this on. I hope I do this right. I got to wait for the little light. There it is. And then I get to turn the engine on. Oh yeah. <laughs> so I'm having fun. Now, a little later, go to our website, MiamiCNews.com, and get all the information and other festivals going on around mid-Michigan. I'm going to toss it back to you guys in the studio. Yeah, it's a hard to hold the mic. Ilse you know. looks good. She's got good. the handlebars. She She's looks got the heels sassy. On. She needs to lay a patch out of that place. Just go you know, right Look on at Ilse. Out. She looks like a biker. She's got a leather jacket on. Ilse could be a biker. Jacket. She could. She could. You go, Ilse. Go. <laughs>